And I don't know too much. Like the year, the, the age gap is crazy. But I think I heard somebody saying like you had like a little boyfriend at a time. Oh, that was Pug. Who? Pug. Oh, Pug. Okay, okay. Cause I, I I might not even know him, but he's a he's he's from Baltimore. Yeah, he be riding the bike and stuff. That's who at the time. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> at the like, time, like that's who. Like, don't be shady. Oh wait, you talking about like a little boy? No, nah, so, I, I so, a... so so yeah, cause we gonna get into it. Cause like I don't know too much, but you got fans. You got fans. No, so that's what I'm saying. No, not know. Pug was not the littlest. But so you had a lit boyfriend in Baltimore. No, yeah, a lit boyfriend in Baltimore. And a lit you, boyfriend from Florida. And then you like left him, nigga, would be with some like. Other lip rapper or something like that. Yeah, I okay. said, when I tell you, listen, that broke the internet. Like, and it's so crazy looking back because I was dead wrong. But what then happened? again, I wasn't. What happened? First give us of again. all, because huh? you, you never talked about this, so give us. I again. never talked about it. So this this is exclusive right here. So this is my side of the story. Okay. Shout out to Puck. I, you feel me? I fuck with it. It's no hard feelings, but it's like he was dragging on me at the time. I was younger. He was a couple years older than me. He locked up talking at bitches from the cell. Just, he was dragging. He was dragging for the jib. Like he had. Coming up there, he was writing me and other bitches the same letter. Like he told me, him and another inmate was writing bitches the same exact letter. Like, he was writing. So I had got another nigga. Mm. Yes, I did. The but I ain't gonna lie, how I went about it was dead wrong. Like I ain't tell him nothing. Like I just started just doing me. But it's like people don't know what he was doing. You know what I'm saying? So it's like when I popped out, they like, bitch, you crazy. Like why would you do that? But so the other guy was a rapper from Florida. Yeah. Who was this? So embarrassing. I don't even wanna. I don't. <laughs> I don't was it? No. Oh, if you know, you know. Is it like, is it somebody like we know or just? Yeah, everybody knows. So why is it embarrassing? I feel because. like, if I, I feel like I've seen it. Yeah, you did see it. So why is it embarrassing? Because. <laughs> I don't but like, I was saying the name. Like, I, yeah, like, no. But I was like, saying the name. Why is it embarrassing? Because, like, how he did me was so. <laughs> hey, you want to talk? Hold on, let me give her this. Ma, so you can talk. This is the part of a um, mom to... No, nah, nah, trust me. I get it. I didn't did, I didn't did content with anyway, my daughter. But no, yeah. it's embarrassing just because how he... How I was done publicly, like, it was no remorse. Like, it was lies. It was embarrassment. It was just everything. Like, it was so embarrassing. Like, just talking to bitches. Mm. Like, fucking different bitches. Like, it was very bad. You know what's funny? I feel like a lot of times when we think about something being embarrassing... It really would be to our circle because I don't know nothing about this. So, right. you know what I'm saying? Like, and I'm pretty sure it's millions of people who don't know nothing about that. Exactly. So, I know it probably seemed like embarrassing to her, but. Yeah, but it's like, it was bad. Like, like nigga, get mad and go live. Like, what type of time you on? Like, what the mm. fuck? And then now looking back, it's like, that's really bad too because I got a daughter too. And it's like, she going to have to see that shit one day. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mm. So, I don't even like, like, it's just something that you can't come back from. And me being older now, I be looking back like, you lame Especially because you were so much older than me doing that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Now, did that have a, a help with the rap career, though? Um, It definitely got me. I ain't going to lie. So I was already lit before any of these niggas. I was doing nails. I was doing everything myself. Like, I was just known as a boss that was working. And then once I got in these relationships, you know, people love to be in business. So they looking at me even more. Mm -hmm. So it definitely helped. It um definitely got me seen a little bit more. Mm. Yo, you know, it's funny, man. Coming from the city, <clears throat> you being like so popular now and being signed and being in the industry. I feel like one thing that I like about the city, but it kind of like set us back when it comes to industry is expecting everybody to be genuine. But I feel like it's the total opposite. I swear to God, I was just talking about, about that to somebody. Like you will try to quote unquote be real, stay down still. Yeah. Like, when they be like, you change, you have to. I yeah. swear to God, that shit is crazy. Cause it's like when you try to stay down with the people that was there before, it's like, you're not the one that changed. It be them changing. Like, mm -hmm. now they looking at you like, damn, like, this is a bitch I grew up with. And now she thinks she all that. Oh, now she got this. Yeah, let me start asking her for shit. Oh, she ain't want to give it to me. This time. That bitch fake. You feel me? Like, it's like a lot of shit. And it's like, I feel like that stigma is is all the way backwards when they say that the the person that started being successful change, it be the people that do. weren't successful change mm -hmm. or are trying to be successful change. Because we be the same people. We be trying to kick it with y'all. I swear to God, I don't give a what you got, I still go back to where my people's at. You know what yeah. I'm saying? But it's like, they don't, I don't know, yo. It's like. And then a lot of times people. And then it be, I'm sorry. Cut you off. Then it be a lot of like hating shit that you'll overlook. Like you will overlook somebody just saying slick shit. Cause it's like, no, I don't want it to be you, bro. Like, mm. I don't want that to be you. Not but then it do be. No, you're right. And then also what I was going to say is, um, I feel like people try to equate like followers with dollars. Right. And a lot of times like, yeah, a nigga might have a lot of motion. 
but that don't mean the money came yet. How like long? I'm working. Like, like I'm working. Like yeah, I signed the deal, but baby, I ain't got no hit yet. The yeah. So it's like y'all asking me for money when you never asked me for money, right? That's what I'm you saying. You expected me to do things. And then for you. you know what's so crazy? It's like they uh, they appreciate the people that never did shit for them more than a <laughs> more than a person that did something for them and said no one time. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Now take your time. I feel like people will appreciate, appreciate the people that didn't do shit for them at all. Mm -hmm. More than a motherfucker that do shit for them and then one time they can't do it at the time. Mm -hmm. Now they look at you like, yeah, because that I asked her for this and she ain't do it. But you cool with this motherfucker that never did shit with you. This, you're telling that to the person that never ever did nothing for you. Mm -hmm. How crazy is that? Mm -hmm. How weird is that? No, you talking shit about somebody not doing something for you one time to the person that never did nothing to you. And that's what I had to realize. It's like, at the end of the day, somebody going to f*** you regardless whether you do something for them or whether not. Mm -hmm. But then an another thing, too, that I realized, that's why sometimes you do have to f*** people with, f with people on the same level as you. Because if you don't, like, they'll really go out their way to sabotage you. They have nothing to lose. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And then some people don't even know how to, don't, know, don't understand success. So, like, sometimes you might be talking about your everyday life and they might think you bragging, right? Yo. They have no, it's like, bro, this is just regular and I'm not trying to be, they, the whole time they like, you think you better than me. He's like, nah, bro, I'm just talking my regular life. Whereas if you're talking to somebody who is just as successful than you or more, God. then they understand, right? I swear to God. <clears throat> so, yeah, I get it, man. What what's, what you think is the most frustrating part of the success so far? That? Like, it feel like <clears throat> nobody really genuine. <clears throat> like, it's like, it's like you can't even go out and really make friends for real because it's like it's always a motive. Rather than when I was still in Baltimore doing this, it's like, yeah, this person fucked me because I'm me. Yep. Now it's like, you can't even fuck with a little nigga. Nigga like, yeah, because I'm fucking on Rick and you're yep. like, yeah, you, nigga don't yep. even fuck with you for real. Nigga just want to say he fucking you or mm. fucking with you mm -hmm. just for the image. Like, I sort of got ahead a nigga that did not even like me for real. Like, nigga did not like me, did not. It was just cool points to say you fucking with me. You nah, know I know. It, it's one thing about the game, no matter how old we are, like, the shit never changed. Like, and I, I say this all the time. I feel like niggas, you know how niggas joke or people joke when they're like, niggas the new bitches? But that's true. It's like, a nigga will. <laughs> Nigga be thoughts for the Instagram check. Like a nigga see a chick with a blue check, mm -hmm. or they press whole time he don't even like her. Like he just oh, wanna she, because she 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 look good she to look everybody lit. else. You know what I'm saying? She lit for everybody else. And it's like, bro, like like what do you like? That's what I'm saying. Like Yeah, nah, it's crazy. Niggas don't want no lit bitch for real. They want the low key bitch that don't got no fault. That's what they want. Mm. Like all that other shit, it just be like You think it's hard dating you? Hell yeah. Cause but, I don't I feel like it is hard dating me. Cause this is what I've been told before, like like, it's like a thousand niggas that's looking at me and it's like, all oh, this Instagram shit. You got all these niggas on Instagram, but it's like, them niggas, I don't know them niggas. Like, that's what be irking me. Mm. I do not be knowing these people. Like, when niggas see me, they be like, oh, she got hella niggas. I don't just be talking to random niggas. Mm -hmm. Like, and this brings back to my daughter again. Like, especially, I have a baby. Like, I cannot just be talking to anybody. I don't know what niggas be on. Like, I don't know what you did. I don't know what you thinking. I don't know what you going to do. I don't know what you're doing right now. Like, right. you know what I'm saying? So, it's, it's just about being picky and... I feel like people think you have followers, you have a lot of options. You do, but it's still slim pickings out here. It's still slim. The fucking dick. Like cool especially guy. me. I don't know how other bitches do, but me, I'm I'm paranoid. Like I don't just fuck. I got a, I got a big ass chain. I don't even be wearing it like that because that shit's so fucking heavy. Like, mm -hmm. and then another thing too, I don't wear it because I be holding my daughter and I don't be want her to put her head on my shit. But it's like I got hella shit to lose and fucking with the wrong nigga, you're going to lose everything. Mm -hmm. You're going to lose everything. No, that's a fact. I, I mean, I know even like, not even like just as far as dating you, that got to be hard dating in general. Mm -hmm. Just trying to find somebody to date. It's almost like you, you know, it's funny because we see people like, people business be on the social media and stuff like that and all these celebrities dating celebrities. But it's like, it's all. it feels like you almost got to date somebody on your level. You okay? have to. Because one, I'm sorry, I like shit. I like, like, I fuck with a nigga, like, it's crazy, because I like a nigga that's not on my level, but then it's like, damn, like, that mean <laughs> I ain't going to get no trips. I ain't going to get no J. I ain't going to get no design. I ain't going to get shit but love and, a, and, a, and some good words. Like, mm. I ain't trying to hear that shit. What the mm. fuck? I do be trying to hear that shit sometimes, but it's like, damn, like, that's all I'm going to get. It's like, now at this point, you got to pick between the 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 luck the the manyan or you gotta pick between the like the 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 words the mm. the good nothings yeah. <laughs> the fuck I mean shit it's funny because you're so young so it's like I understand but it's like what what would you rather have though I ain't gonna lie right now nothing I'm I'm gonna just wait I'm gonna just wait until the the per I'm not chasing shit I'm gonna wait until that shit come to me like I don't give a fuck what it is like 
Because I don't want no nigga that's just buying me shit and treating me like shit and not giving me that part. Because I done had a nigga that was buying me everything, but it's like like mentally, like, like the chemistry was not there and it was draining. Mm. And then I had a nigga that really, really liked me, but it's like, damn, like, I got to pay for everything. No, I'm not doing that. Mm. <laughs> like, I'll pay, I'll help you get on your feet. But as far as, like, taking trips for my birthday and it's like, I'll be thinking about all that shit, like, no. No, nah, I mean, that is different, though. <laughs> like, sorry, having I'm to not. pay for your own birthday trip. No, I'm and not. And then pay for other people, too. No, I'm is not. crazy. When I have a nigga, no, I'm not. That's yeah. why I'm just like, uh-uh. But, I mean, what do you expect out of, like, somebody that's 24 or 25? That's what I'm saying, because I'm so young and it's, like, hard. It's like, you got to be with a granddaddy. <laughs> Oh, you got to be with a young nigga that's like, it's like, shit. Yeah. That's all. Right now, I'm in a space where it's like, I'm cool. Like, I'm cool on everybody. I mm. swear to God. Like, I got my daughter. That's all I, that's all I need. I don't need. If a nigga, right, he's going to fall right there. I don't mm. need to chase or look or any of that shit draining as fuck. 